6 minus 9 gives us negative 3. And again here, inside this parenthesis, we have 6 minus 9. Okay? So, negative 3 times negative 3, which equals positive 9. But this answer is not correct. Because according to the order of operations, first we have to do parentheses, then exponents, then multiplication or division, and finally addition or subtraction. Remember that multiplication and division have equal priority and we have to work from left to right. And the same applies to addition and subtraction. Here, in this expression, we have one div uh, subtraction, one multiplication, and one parenthesis. Inside this parenthesis, we have one subtraction. Here, we have a multiplication because in mathematics, when a number is placed next to parentheses, it means multiplication. And we usually don't write the multiplication sign for brevity. Okay, so according to the PEMDAS, first we have to do this parenthesis, then this multiplication, and finally this subtraction. If we do this subtraction before this multiplication or this parenthesis, it is wrong. Six minus nine gives us negative three. So we have six minus nine times negative three. No. In this expression, we have one subtraction and one multiplication. According to the PEMDAS, multiplication has higher priority than subtraction. Multiplication comes before subtraction. So here, first we have to do this multiplication, then this subtraction. Negative 9 times negative 3 gives us positive 27. So we have 6 plus 27, which equals 30. Three. And this is our final answer to this problem. The correct answer is 33.